Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, thank you very much. Thank you. Hey, uh, thank you. Thank you. I appreciate y'all being here. Thank you. All right, before I get started, I just want to thank you. I want to, uh, <laughs> yeah, you too. Yeah, I just want to uh, tell everybody thank you for watching my watching my videos, subscribing to my channel. So it's uh, been moving right along. We've got a lot of a lot of stuff going on, a lot of new things going on in America. One thing I read the other day that I'd like to try to get out to everybody, if uh, if I can get it out a little bit, is the the mom that wrote the letter to uh, Obama. Because you know that Obama and his wife, and I guess his kids, his mom, his wife's mom, grandparents, whoever they can get, their friends, relatives, why do we as Americans have to struggle like we do? Been to fire service 18 years. Haven't had not one penny raised, not one penny. And, uh, and going on nine years, that's a long time because the research shows that in nine years, everything has gone up between 500 and 700 percent. It's absolutely ridiculous. How are we, Mr. Obama, supposed to save money for our kids to go to a, a good college, get a good education? How are we supposed to get them in their sport, sporting activities, maybe art classes, music, get on private lessons? Because I used to do it before you came president with my parents. Yeah, sometimes it was hard for them. Could have been hard for them all the time. But I was able to do it. Now we can't save one dime. And I want to compare the health insurance with slavery. Because basically that's all it is. Because in the Constitution, all the power used to be with the people of America. Now, so fast it's changed and all the power has shifted to the government. So now it's time to bring the power back to the people. That's like at your job. It's, it's not the, the, the managers, the chiefs, the whoever's above you. They're not the power. They're, not, they're, they're just there as a, a figure to place orders, to get stuff together, to, to help us to make our job easier and to fight for, for what we need to get the job done. So the power needs to go from up here back to the people that do the work. Also, going back to uh, the mom that, that uh, wrote this letter stating that uh, how many vacations have you gone on, uh, Mr. Obama? You can't even count that high. They millions and millions and millions of dollars. Why do you have to buy thousands of dollars worth of new clothes to, to look good to go to China? Michelle, why do you got to take your kids, I guess it was your mom that went, I'm not real sure who it was, it's, all, it's always something different, but why couldn't the news media be there, because it cost so much, was it a vacation, is there something else going on behind the scenes, because I can't even afford to take my kids to Disney World, yeah, they want to go, but I have to tell them, no, I can't go, because the health care has gone up, food's gone up, gas has gone up, so all the clothes that you're buying, Look at this. You know where this is from? It's from Goodwill. I don't care, but I want my kids to have something good, so I have to cut back on what I'm doing, Mr. Obama. What kind of health care you have right now? Has your health care gone up? Have you gotten a raise in the past nine years? This is the stuff this mom was saying. I wish I had it in front of me so I could go over it word for word because it's uh, absolutely just sickening. And everything she says is so true. And all this, this fake facade that the, the president has going on, trying to make it like everything's okay. Nobody wants the stinking health care that the, the Obamacare. Because anybody who thinks that is good is an idiot. They're a bunch of dummies. They believe everything they hear coming out of your mouth. But there's a select few of us that don't buy into all that bull. And we know it's not true. And the people need to, need to take back over... Uh, just like our founding fathers uh, started. It's for the people. Not for you. Not for you to go take your vacations and, and play your golf. Get on the front of Rolling Stone magazine. 
Michelle Obama's doing her little uh, her little dance on Jimmy Kimmel or whatever his name is on Saturday Night Live or whatever she was doing. You know, it's uh, it's pretty sickening. You know, she even went to say, hey, have you ever had to put a patch on your pants or a patch on your shirt just to get through so you don't have to, uh, you can't afford to go buy another shirt or a pair of pants? Guarantee you had, he's wearing thousands of dollars worth of suits every day or his golfing pants or his little collar shirt. It's not what a president needs to be doing. Like right now, uh, Vladimir Putin, he's running all over you. He's physically fit. He shoots guns. He loves guns. Not saying that I like the guy, but he thinks of America about that much. He don't care. He just thumps America away and puts us in the garbage. He don't care what we think anymore because we're not a stronghold anymore because we don't have anybody to lead this country right now. But guys, uh, just kind of want to throw that out there and think about these things, man. Look at what's changing. They want our guns. Our health care has gone up. The, the workforce has gone down. People are struggling every day just to make ends meet. It's happening right, right in front of your eyes. So guys, please start paying attention. Read. Get the facts. Listen to the, the Ben Carson. He is awesome. He has a lot of good uh, facts. He's got some stuff on YouTube. He has a book out. Get it. Read what he has to say. He's a smart man. And he's, he's against this whole administration we have going on right now. And, uh, and things do need to, need to change. But uh, One last thing, guys. It's Mark Sanders with Blackout 33. You don't have to be 100% ready tomorrow. Just be 100% ready today. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hope to see you next time. Thank you. And it made me forget everybody up there in the balcony. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all have a good one. Blackout 33.